Across the Commonwealth, 43 out of our 67 counties have abandoned mine lands. Now, thanks to recent funding, plans are underway to clean one up here at home. Fox 56's Taylor Wardenby has more from Luzerne County. Senator Bob Casey says almost a million and a half Pennsylvanians live within a mile of an abandoned mine, which can cause serious health and safety hazards within our communities. Now, funds to revitalize damaged mine land near Wilkes-Barre has been secured thanks to a new infrastructure law. With funding from the Infrastructure Investment and Jobs Act, nearly $1.4 million will be used to recover 3,000 acres of that land in the Lower South Valley Energy Park. Pennsylvania has already received $270 million for abandoned mine land cleanup. Yeah, this is uh, the result of uh, anthracite coal mining over many generations, and uh, it's created all kinds of environmental hazards as well as public health hazards. What this funding announcement today will, will be directed towards is abandoned mine land cleanup, and it allows us to restore this, this uh, uh, area right here and create uh, a, a stream that used to be here a long time ago. Senator Casey says in the longer term, the quality of life will enhance economic growth. Uh, this is a, a significant watershed restoration project that Earth Conservancy is going to be undertaking. Um, we're restoring over 15,000 linear feet of Nanticoke Creek stream, um, which runs from the headwaters here uh, in the Truesdale Terrace area of Hanover Township, uh, all the way down to the Susquehanna River. All this water that ponds up here infiltrates into the underground mine pools where, where it comes into contact with the uh, underground mine work. Where we're standing right now is basically where the watershed is, is cut off. It, it can no longer flow beyond this because there's this large embankment that's here, large embankment that was created by the coal mining industries. And with the project here completely funded, it is estimated to be completed within three to five years. Reporting in Luzerne County, I'm Taylor Wharton B. With Fox 56 News, first at 10. Senator Casey says he had to pass a law to correct part of the infrastructure bill that did not allow set-aside money for acid mine drainage.